What's up gamers and welcome back to another episode of Blake is Trash at Fighting Games where I take this god tier hair and L tier gaming skill into fighting games that I love and try not to be so absolutely ass at them. Now I have some good news for you on the Tekken 8 front. I have made it into the yellow ranks. That's right, we're out of green town with our boy Law. We mashed our way through, but we definitely barely got out with our sanity for sure and you know, with our life intact. And there's no easy way to say this, my Tekken journey has barely just begun and that is evidently clear with how hard it was for me personally to get out of green into yellow. I have no idea how it's going to be going up in yellow and trying to get out of that rank. But we'll worry about that for another series of videos. And that's why we're here today. We're trying to get a little bit better at Tekken 8. And the focus of this video is going to be on one matchup in particular that I am just absolutely trash at. I'm telling you, this matchup continues to cartwheel head kick me to loss after loss after loss and you've probably guessed it it's none other than lily now i get it she looks totally innocent with her salty <laughs> cat but i assure you she's more of a demon than nezuko from demon slayer so with today's video, what we're going to do is take a look at some of my most recent losses to Lily Mains and try, emphasis on try, because I'm basically still a Tekken 8 amoeba at this stage. But we're going to try and identify my mistakes, look at some of the tips from the replays and try and improve my gameplay. And then my goal here is, is to take what I'm seeing in these games and go apply it in a super ghost match versus a really good Lily. Because there's just absolutely no way I'm going to hang out waiting for RNGesus to show me another Lily in ranked. So I figured a super ghost was the next best thing and it's a feature i haven't used in tekken that i've been really curious about so grab yourself some popcorn you might as well get you a crispy sip and sit back and buckle up because these losses from lily are gonna be pretty bad but let's hop on in and see how i can improve oof oh we actually get the engager out okay there's the mid man do we do this convincingly or nope here it comes okay we're on player two side we're sketching out right now i can already hear myself just having a meltdown on twitch right now like i'm on player two side and i don't even know what to do oh and then they hit me with this Ooh, but we get away with a random nunchuck to get us out of the rage art problem pretty sure it's this one where they actually get me a bunch of times with rage art and it's not great that double mid and then they launch me again go for the same thing they almost had like a serious combo there but they missed the second high. Yep. And Rage Art. Now this is not enough. Is it enough to kill? Because they're so low health wise. No, I don't think it's enough to kill. That would be nuts if it was. All right. So there's flower petals everywhere. They hit me with the heat engager. I'm pretty sure they tornado me to death. Because I just played a little bit too passive and dealt. Yeah, I ate a lot of chip damage and a low hit there. That's a big one. Like, I think one thing I have been doing wrong is like, yes, I want to block, but I'm not closing the space enough to actually play Tekken. I'm leaving too much space. That was a weird one I've never seen. They weren't hitting that like tornado heel kick twister on me a bunch, but the movement, they were sidestepping a bunch of shit. I didn't even notice it. Yep, me trying to step up on her and get back to P1 side because I'm so nervous on P2. Lots of craziness right now. We do manage to actually get the the throw off, or I guess the grab, but it, it didn't swap me sides, which is kind of weird. Usually it does. All right, they hit me with a hard mid up stop. We hit a lot of good blocks, and then I just stopped blocking. I thought it was my turn, and it was definitely not. This would be a good one to rewatch for just like frame data and try and understand when their turn ends. I've been trying to be better about like counting out how many times I'm getting hit. And try and like get to that like three to four range and be like, okay, I probably should be okay. And then here we go, Rage Art. Yep, we get Rage Art to death here. And they get, I'm pretty sure they take this pretty convincingly at the end as well. Because I'm on, I'm on P2 side, I just got Rage Arted. I'm giving them way too much space and giving them way too much space advantage for me. Yep. Yep, they launch me with the up kick. Because it also when I'm on P2 side, I found that I don't block as well. So being on P2 is a big problem for me and something that needs a lot of practice. All right, we get a we finally get a down back four in again. We're trying to check them with that 3-4-4, four, four, and it does not work. They hit me with the heat engager. They keep missing that tornado, and I should be whiffing it. I, that would probably be a good one for down forward two, although they look like they're a little bit off axis, so I'm actually not sure if down forward two would even hit them. And we're chalked. Wait, wait, hold on. Oh, my God, dude. 
The rage art. So I want to take take a second to admit something. I don't know how to do my rage art. All right, well, while we stare into Lily's demon eyes, and I'll talk a little bit about what I think I've picked up. Big thing, I don't have a solid combo. I've definitely been working on it on my streams, doing like combo and coffees in the morning, but it's not solid enough that I feel comfortable with it. It's definitely not in a place where it's muscle memory. Watching this set of matchups against Lily, I need a solid combo that I can hit without really having to focus too much on it. So that's a work in progress. The other thing I noticed, I am not taking advantage of my plus frames. Like there was a lot of times where I had done down back four or I had launched somebody and I just kind of like brain farted and stared at him and looked at him. So that's a big thing. Following up once I've launched somebody or following up when I'm in plus frames to at least get like a low off or be prepared to hit that while running three, even if they block it. The other thing I've noticed is I have not learned my rage art. I don't even know what button it is on my controller. I need to figure out what that is because at my ranks, it's being used so often against me that I need to figure out how to do it. The other thing that I need to be paying attention to is if I'm gonna put somebody that I'm fighting in a rage art state, I need to be prepared to deal with it. I need to play a little bit more backdashy, if you will, and give them some space to launch that rage art at me so that I can effectively block it. Cause like you saw a bunch of times here, I just let them hit me and I kind of sold the match because of it. The other thing that didn't show up as much, but I personally know that I need to work on it cause I'm sure that this is gonna keep being a problem. Tekken grabs. Like there's a, an easy fix for that. And basically hitting one or two right now is probably going to be my best bet. Uh, but I'm not visually seeing the grabs fast enough for me to actually react. Uh, but there's so many grabs that are not going to be a two break that I just need to start programming my brain to like try and smash one or two if I see a grab coming up. I don't know about you guys, but I feel like she's taking a little bit of my soul. I'm not mad at it, but I just wanted to point it out. Anyway, let's take a little bit of what I've learned here and go hop into a super ghost match. So I flipped the script a little bit and just downloaded a ghost of a Lily that's the same level as me. So maybe I'll actually be able to implement some of the things that I've learned from watching the Lily videos during this video, or I'll just embarrass myself, in which case that's fine. All right, I appreciate you. Let's jump into the battle. Concentration breathing. I don't care what they say, I'm looking good. I have not seen this. I didn't realize we were getting a cat in a helmet. Okay. Okay. Wow. Whoa, there's that low. Oh God, I'm getting beat so bad. Oh God. Should have looked up the Rage Art button. Oh, I didn't look up the Rage Art button. This is what we get. All right, while running two? Nope. Okay, we're on the terrible side. All right, we'll heat engage because that's all I can really think to do over here. Back up. There we go. Let's go. That's one round. That's one round. I was still terrified on side two, though. All right, let's kick things off with a 3-4. Oh, that was a... Wow. Oh, okay. I see you. I see you. How about those? Oh, my. Okay, they did it twice. All right, get up. Up. There we go. Hit that. Oh, all right. We're two, three. We're two, three. We can come back. We can come back. I think. I hope. Let's pray. Engage water breathing. Don't forget to block. Okay. Should have punished that. There we go. Hit him with the low. All right. I think I need to engage. Okay. That was stupid. Not what I intended, but here it is. Yes. All right, we lucked out. We traded. Oh, we traded. Here we go. This is this is what makes or breaks us. I didn't mean to do that. I won't lie to you. One ring two. Low kick again. Okay, we lucked out there a little bit. Okay, there we go. Nunchucks. All right, that's not what I meant to do. 
Oh god, we didn't learn. We didn't learn. I think I'm okay though. I'm, I got plenty of life. They're not that dead. Ah, sh we didn't learn anything from our training. We are not using our concentration breathing right now. Oh no. Not like this. Not like this! Oh my god, put me in the trash where I belong. <laughs> if I lose to Lily, I have to say that. Do you think they run it back? <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna run it back. I don't know if this is gonna end up making it in the video, but we'll see if we get redemption, because I feel like this video is already gonna be long enough, and that was a five minute battle. Alright, we're trying to get redemption here. Alright, it seems like- oh wow, I did not expect that. All right, that seems like my best starter. Roaring two. There we go. Okay. A little mix-up action. Okay, they're rage arting. All right. Woo! Four, four, three. Let's go. All right, block, block. Okay, block. All right, they're going to hit you with lows. They're definitely going to hit you with lows, so it's all good. All right, there we go. Heat engage. Boom. Oh, they hit that. Okay. They weren't ready for it the second time, though. Oh, God. Block. Block. Okay. Block a lot. There we go. That's like my bread and butter. I've got to get away from that. All right, let's get it down forward, two in this piece. Start with that 3-4. There we go. Get them off me. Okay. They come up with that nonsense. All right, there we go. All right, we got to do it because I'm this close. Back three, back three, back three. Let's go. I think I have to run the set. <laughs> four or two out of me. All right, let's kick it off with the three, four again. Ooh, okay. They keep doing that every time they get up. All right, let's close the gap. There we go. Homing kick. I didn't mean to run through them, but I guess I did. Okay. Now, they've been using Rage Art on me constantly, so let's be prepared. Oh, I'm an idiot. There we go. Okay, punish. There we go. Oh, let's go! Chip damage for the win! I've never been so excited fighting a bot. All right, we, we kick it off with the 3-4. I don't know if the bot learns as well as a human, which is kind of sus. Oh, man, I messed up my down 4-2. Ah, and they got me with the low. Oh! Ah, I meant to heat engage there. I, I don't know what I'm doing on that one. Let me do that again. Okay, that's not what I intended, but here we are. Oh, sh Okay, we're going to heat engage because I'm terrified of this side. And I don't really want to lose to a... I don't understand what this really is. It feels like it's a bot, but it's also not necessarily supposed to be a bot. Okay, block, block, block. Cool. Oh, that's, a ho that's my homing kick, so let's just get that in. Oh, God. Oh, God, we're in trouble here. I just back up, back up. Oh, wow, too much, too much. Back it up. Oh, God, I can't spin. Um, I'm sweating. Okay, still sweating. There we go. Low kick. Oh, that was supposed to be a down back four. Like this. <laughs> oh, God, I f***ed it up twice. Oh, wow. I almost just lost that from doing the same thing, like getting frame advantage and then not doing anything. All right. Well, GG's because <laughs> that was insane. I really enjoyed trying the Super Ghost thing. I really wish I had been able to find like Feedy X's Super Ghost and just got my ass handed to me. That was still a really tough matchup. I didn't expect to run the entire set back to back at all, but here we are. But as always, I appreciate you watching this video. And remember, the only way to move forward is to never quit.